Right now, we're looking, working to learn more about police activity in Fairfield. Officers have been investigating around a neighborhood for several hours now. This was from Plum Tree Way to Peach Tree Drive and Pear Tree to Apple Tree Lanes. That's the perimeter of this investigation. Let's go live now to KCRA3's Leanne Denier. Leanne, what are you seeing out there tonight? We see the crime scene tape behind you. Yeah, so we're on Orange Tree Way, uh, but like you mentioned, at a point there was several neighborhood or several streets, excuse me, that were involved in this. But since then, Fairfield Police has said they have cleared the area. However, you'll see right behind me that there is still a scene, and like you mentioned, we are still trying to figure out exactly what's going on. You can see that there are some people going in and out of this house here on Orange Tree Way in Fairfield. We can see that the police department is here. We can also um, see that the fire department is here but as to what exactly happened what is going on what exactly they're investigating we're still trying to get some details on that we have been in contact with the fairfield police department but so far they have been unable to answer our questions just saying that they had been able to open up some of the traffic uh, from this investigation but in terms of what exactly they were investigating they said they just couldn't give us that information at this point but from our vantage point it does appear that they're just focused on this one house uh, here on my left they have yellow tape up on either side of it, really only impacting these two houses that are right here. Um, neighbors that we spoke to just quickly before we came on the air said that they didn't know what was going on. So certainly a lot of questions at this point. And while the impact to traffic does appear that it's been largely wrapped up, this investigation is still going on. We're going to work to learn more and relay that back to you as soon as possible. In Fairfield, Leanne Denier, KCRA 3 News. Leanne, thank you for the update.